Hello and welcome survivors to the entrance of the cave that transitions between Black Rock and Timberwolf Mountain. In the Black Rock region of Great Bear Island in the Long Dark. And we're picking up right where we left off. Full continuity. That'll come in handy. All we did was we spent the night in there. I think we can get down this way. So it was uh, um we just brewed up some tea and some coffee. Now the thing is we could have went out in the blizzard, but we were pretty tired anyway. Um going out in the blizzard it would be a good idea right now because this is Timberwolf country. And that would keep them at bay. Hopefully, anyway. But where we're going isn't far away. We are going to... Bricklayer's Retreat. This is a great place. Now, a moose does spawn right in front of it, right near it. I don't know if he spawns there or just passes by. So we kind of got to keep our eyes open. Don't see him yet. Okay, so we are on a hunt. For a rifle. Don't see him. So we could go through that cave we just left and go to Timberwolf Mountain. And we would the chances of us finding a rifle there are pretty good. But then we have to deal with all the loot and stuff, and we would probably find better clothes. Then we have to deal with all the loot and stuff. And I really want to get to Black Rock. But in order to get to Black Rock, we have to find this a rifle. And kill a moose first. That's my goal. So we, we it's got a cure for ten days, so we can make the moose hide satchel. So I think that's a good idea. There are two spots if we just follow this wall and make our way up towards the top of the map. There's two spots that could have a rifle. I feel like this moose is just gonna sneak up on me. And the chances of them being there are so slim. So from there, we can probably go to the mine instead of going to Timberwolf. Okay, so this is a cabin, you know, similar to the one on like Timberwolf Mountain. What's this? A sports vest. Ooh, a flashlight. But it's all messed up. The door is broken off of it. And. The beds aren't as nice. What's the warmth bonus? Nine. But there is... But there is a bricklayer's retreat. Hell yeah. A workbench outside. Which is great, especially for... This stuff will come in handy. Yeah, it will. Especially for crafting items that take a long time. Because you don't... Ooh, that was nice. A sewing kit. Because you don't want to spend all your time indoors in a indoor workbench. Because you'll give you in danger of having fever. So this kind of makes it easier. I think I can use this. Oh, another seven kit. I always check the boats. They usually have good stuff, it seems. Here, Moosey, Moosey. I think he comes from that way and hangs out there here. But he may not spawn because we just got here. Oh no, we did spend a night. Now, over this hill right... Up that way is uh, a possible bunker. 
and I was hoping it would be there and I was hoping it would be a weapons bunker. We're not getting cold right now. What time of day is it? Why is it so dark in here? And wood matches. They may be guaranteed to be there. I'm not I'm not hundred percent sure. Okay, so this place does have one of these cool hatches. Store stuff. It holds 88 pounds. Alright, so it's not too late in the day. But I think we're gonna take off. We managed to get our weight down to 52.77. Go ahead and drink some water, get some of that weight off, even though it doesn't make any sense. the sound of that ice cracking. This is a potential spawn for a hacksaw, but I didn't see one. Maybe I missed it. Ah! Okay, so we're gonna head straight. Straight out the door across the water. In an attempt to avoid timber wolves. Now there's a prepper cache spawn on the top of that hill over there, and I think there's one on the top of this hill over here. Yeah, I have a feeling I would want to stay to the left of this hill. That would be smarter. I mean, we could just climb over it, I guess. Kind of a waste of energy doing this. I don't want to see if there's any timber wolves in the immediate vicinity. head to this wall that's kind of like in front of us right here and I think we want to get up there that deer scared the crap out of me you're lucky I don't have a rifle buddy yeah so if you come this way if you're following along and you already have a A rifle you don't really have to go the way I'm going but there's a chance there's a chance for a Polaroid I can't get up here there's a chance for a Polaroid at this hunting blind and of course is that it over there yeah And the other spot that's after this one is a backpack with, even if the rifle's not there, there's still a backpack to work through and a couple pieces of coal too, which are pretty valuable. Big opening's crazy. Alright, this is a good spot to map. Whistling Perch. Very nice. So it's basically just straight north from the Bricklayer's Retreat. And there is no rifle here. You're breaking my heart, game. You're breaking my heart. Wonder if this is any good to eat. I will just eat it. And hold. 
poor old photo there is text code on the back found a higher spot to get a shot of the prison for you tried to make it scenic are power lines scenic question mark so we're going to take that bad boy and mark that uh, where we need to go visit This is a Black Rock Vista, which is going to be on our way back to Black Rock probably when we go back to Black Rock But what is this? It's like Archway Either way, we're going to run into Timberwolves. It's getting foggy. This looks really familiar. Wow, that's cool. I guarantee you can go up top there, but you probably can't get there from here. You're probably like on the other side of the map where you have to get up there. I'm pretty sure I've never seen this before. That's crazy. Doesn't have a name? Oh no, I have seen this. Okay. This will bring us right to the mine, okay. This may actually be a way to avoid Timberwolves. Or not. I just want to check and see if there's a rope on here. There is. There's a bridge to the mine over there that's open in story mode, but it's washed out or, or destroyed in this mode. So you can't get across, but if you go to the right before you, there's like a little tiny cave. We'll visit it, visit it another time. There's a little tiny cave and, uh, There's a little time cave and there's possibly a rifle in there. And there is a backpack, like I said, two pieces of coal. Yeah, it's up there. Alright, so need a little water. What I think I'm going to do is... This is a huge, huge, long road. I would be terrified if I was had to climb this in real life. Does it bring us down to just a wedge? What's happening? Okay. We're gonna have to go down this tree. Gotta be something under this waterfall, right? Or near it. There's a wolf over there, I'm not going. Oh, I'll be pissed if there's nothing here. There we go. What is this? Why then, eh? 
Don't cry. Is it food or? Is it food or? Yeah, oh, yeah, it's food. Oh, there's coal here too, eh? We need that. Well, probably not. I figure why I leave it down here. Their weight right now. Get your five. We came down this tree, and I heard some wolves when we went up near the waterfall. But oh, it's creepy. I don't think it was. It's possible they're up top, but I doubt it. Chances are they're right down here with us. Dang it. I don't want to get too tired. Well, we have, I know there's a rope up here. We have to climb. Holy crow. Should have went down that way. Oh, I went the wrong way. And I cannot get back up. <sighs> that was awful. Okay, so we need to use this. And I don't think I have any painkillers. Nope. Now, I think there's also a cave over here if you need to get some rest before you climb the rope. I'm pretty sure the wolves can't come in here. Or They can't come in here, so I'm gonna go ahead and light a torch up. We gotta start a fire anyway. Mm -hmm. Why is It seems like there's a lot of glow off this torch. Okay, let's start a fire with the torch. 60% chance, that's pretty ghetto. But that's why we have that's why we're using the torch, so we can just come on reuse it instead of blowing through matches. Oh, we have a ton of coal on. Screw D3. And Get some water on right away. And maybe a cup of coffee. Oh, we don't have water for it, that's right. And what do we have for... up clothing. Boots are pretty shot and these pants are pretty shot. Oh, it failed. It sucks. I'll do another water and a cup of coffee in this one. I'll 
take it. Oh, it's starting to blow snow, huh? Uh, an hour and 40. Give me some more water. Uh, I'm wondering if we shouldn't do the tin and commit. Uh, soup, but we really need the water. But we really like the soup. Go ahead and drink this. Mm. And this. And how much water does that give us? That's good for now. We'll pick this up. What's our weight? 9974 which we need to get some sleep I think we'll be warm in here no matter what let's just go ahead and eat stale beef jerky and we're gonna go ahead and take a torch from here and you know what? This is what we'll do. Cook. Water down bolty slots and I'm gonna run to the back of the cave and sleep back here just in case. I really hope it's not crazy blowing snow when we wake up. stats are okay. Sleep like four hours and see where that gets us. It's charcoal and this should be Boiled, yeah. Go ahead and drink that one. Alright, let's roll. Stop running. And reload your weapon. Probably should have got a little more sleep, huh? Could have harvested some meat, I guess. Oops, I want to save my energy. Why is our energy going down by two? We're too heavy. Yeah, you know what? Maybe. Oh, how heavy is that coal? We really don't need the second hatchet. Um, I think it's actually going to do anything, but we'll drink that. I don't think we're going to make it up in one shot. I think we're going to have to rest on the ledge. Trying to try, but I think, I think that'd be stupid. So let's just go ahead and sleep for at least one hour just to make sure, just to be on the safe side. Of course, now it's blowing super hard. I hope we can still find our way. Mm. 
Alright, so we're gonna run up this log real quick. Oh, this rope is long too, huh? What is with this weird window thing? My field of view. That's bugging me out. Okay, so we can't... Yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to get up this. As is. I absolutely never do that, especially because it was my last one. But we have a bunch of them. Oh, maybe it's not as long as I thought. Yeah, that was probably a waste of a stim. Yeah, that was a waste. That's right. This glitch thing is messing me up. I don't like that at all. I've restarted the game since. But I didn't restart Steam or to try to restart an old computer, we'll see what happens. That's yeah, gone now. I don't know why that happened. Okay, so there's a cave over here. We're getting real cold real fast. I would map this up for you, but of course I can't. It's blowing so hard. I just want to hurt like a bear or something. Okay, so there's a hand. Hunting knife, we don't really need it. Curve firewood. I'm I'd lay down right here if I thought I'd ever wake up again. Probably gonna leave that there. We are getting warm. Uh, let's, yeah, let's go ahead and sleep. Four hours at least. Actually, I don't trust. It could get cold at any time, because it's blowing so hard. I don't trust it. And let's go ahead and drink some agua. And we should probably eat too. And what do I have for crappy food? I should already know this. That'll be good enough for now. That was weird, that like window pane thing that was in our, our field of view. It was kind of like it had something to do with the valley or the ropes or something. It was only happening back there. I've never seen anything like that before. Okay, so at the sign. So we came from the rope that way, but that's a sign to take a right and go up this little valley thing here. And we actually should get, yeah we are Not sheltered. sure why I feel so tired. We should get sheltered, we are sheltered. The reason you feel tired buddy is because you're carrying way too much stuff, you haven't gotten enough sleep, you just climbed a huge rope. When you do that you popped an, uh, I think an adrenaline stimulant, which is gonna, you know, Make your body go nuts. And from that, you are crashing. We, we haven't been getting our crafting and cooking skill up, so I'm, oops, I'm harvesting these. And we are sheltered, and there's a lot of them in one spot. So we're going to the mine, and the reason we're going to the mine is because the mine holds a key code that you have to find. And that code is for the door at the workshop at, in Black Rock Prison. Very important, that's the whole reason. Oh! oh I wanted to harvest those hips. Oh well. Normally, <coughs> I just jumped down these climbs, but... 
Not today, apparently. So yes, we need to get the key code for it. Should be hidden back there. The workshop of Black Rock so we can make some noisemakers and get our get around here a little easier. I may actually play around a little bit with the ballistic vest too. I don't know what made me think of that. We're getting cold right now, we're not even gonna check it out. We're gonna follow these tracks. I listen to the sound effects in the wind, that's rad. Oh, it's creepy as hell. There's some coal out here. There's a whole yard to check over there. We're gonna get into that, but right now we're gonna go into the mine. And we should get warm the whole time in here, right? This is a great... This, this is a really fun mine. This is gonna be a, a lot of fun. And... Um, yeah, you know what? Let's tease you a little bit. So this is the old entrance to the mine in story mode. It's collapsed now. And we have all this. Now you have to find a code for this in story mode. But it's open now. And there is going to be a good amount of goodies in here for sure. And then we're going to head into this mine and explore the heck out of it. It's a lot of fun. But that is for the next episode. So you definitely want to come back for that. Where's the phone? Just notes. IOUs. And so it's good to see you guys. I will see you in the next one. Make sure you subscribe so you can come back and hang out with us. And as always, peace.